The Harriman High School community is mourning tonight after a student was killed in a crash involving a school bus. Tonight, news specialist Andrew Adams spoke to several students who are going to miss their classmate and friend. Andrew? Bryson Hathaway was a well-loved student here. His friends and classmates are simply in disbelief tonight that he's gone. It's hard to put words to a scene like this. They're like something bad might have happened. It's even harder when you put a face to it. Never, never imagined what could have happened. Drake Elliott had just said goodbye to his friend, Bryson Hathaway. He didn't know it would be for the last time. I don't know. It's just, it's just surreal. Police say Hathaway drove into the back of a stopped bus on Bangor Highway. They wished they knew why. There's going to be a lot of... I mean, Harriman's going to be missing a lot without him. Just hours after the crash, Hathaway's classmates gathered to remember him. You couldn't find a single person that dislikes Bryson. They say the 17-year-old senior was well-loved at Harriman High School. He's the sweetest kid you'll ever meet. Me and him played football together since we were eight. Hathaway, they say, was a feared competitor on the field and off an energetic, hardworking genius who had aspirations to go into the Air Force. He just did his thing all the time. But friends say most memorable was how much Hathaway cared. For every single person, if he didn't know them, if he did know them, and he was just a friend to everyone, no matter what. Life without Bryson, they say, will forever be different. We drive to school together like every almost every day. So, I mean, it's just weird to like, he's not gonna be doing that with me anymore. His loss in such a violent crash has left them speechless. Just to keep your friends close and tell everyone you love them every day. There's already some talk among Hathaway's friends on how to remember him the rest of the year. Because he loved baseball, there may be something related to the season. Grief counselors will be on hand tomorrow here at Harriman High School, as well as the rest of the week, potentially next week. In Harriman, Andrew Adams, KSL 5 News. It's too bad.